Yo, what's up guys? Brown Leaf Beardsman here. Let me go ahead and light this up here. This is a half finished bowl of um, Early Morning Pipe by Peterson. Perfect in the morning, and uh, some coffee as well. Black coffee. Now, um, I was smoking this a little while ago, and in the middle of my smoking, I uh, checked my phone and checked on one of my uh, UPS schedules or scheduled deliveries. And I saw that uh, a package that was actually uh, delayed up quite a bit, quite a number of days from uh, the Pipe Nook from Eddie Gray. Saw that it was delivered about an hour and a half ago. So went down to the mailbox, picked that up. Wanted to share with you guys. First box on uh, on camera here. So I'll go ahead and use my uh, my check tool, the uh, I guess the pick part of it, just to I don't have a pocket knife on me. So let's take a look here. I should have gotten a pocket knife. <laughs> Man, we had some crazy, insane uh, winter storms. Well, insane for Texas. Uh, not very crazy for the other part of the country, but power went out. Uh, basically, had to go and get a generator since we don't really need one other than, um, other than right now. It's a kind of a crazy situation. Power went out for a couple days here and... Uh, that doesn't really happen too often, so we kind of, we were a bit ill prepared. We don't really have winter storms like the uh, the northern states do, to be honest. We haven't had snow here in about nine and a half years, and uh, it's a blessing and a curse. So <laughs> I wish I could see snow. So all right, first thing here, guys, from the pipe nook. So these are a couple of straight couple of straight black uh, Danish bits the little ridge here I really like that style these are for my country gentlemen I want to keep that one a straight pipe uh, so got two of those just in case just in case any clenching that messes them up and I mean they're a dollar so you can't really go wrong uh, then I got two Danish bents and these would be for my Fifth Avenue diplomat uh, I really really like this color and I think this will add a cool element to that pipe I'm excited to put those on there those were also a dollar uh, then we got one here, a tin of tobacco, Old Dublin by Peterson. Haven't tried this ever, and uh, I'm excited to as well. So let me go ahead and read it a little bit here. A supreme pipe tobacco based on the smoky aroma of Cypress Latakia. To perform this gem, or to perfect this gem of a, t of a tobacco, there are selected golden Virginias with aromatic black Cavendish and sweet Greek Oriental Bosma grades added. Strength four, Aromatic taste three, room note two. I'll have to go do a little bit of research and see what those uh, what those scales mean, or what that scale means, those numbers. So we got the pipe bits, some Old Dublin Peterson tobacco, which I'll be smoking maybe maybe a little bit later on today. Also, we got a cob. Ordered a third cob just so I can have an extra pipe to add in the rotation. That's nice. That is called a Mark Twain. Wow.
I will be putting one of these Danish bits on it. I prefer it much, much prefer it over the black straight. I'm not going to use that. I have some balsa filters. There we go. I like it much, much better than the black. Yeah, once again, guys, it's, so it's a bent Danish bit with a Mark Twain cob, corn cob pipe uh, from Missouri Meerschaum. So yeah, anyways, guys, we got the uh, tobacco, Old Dublin, Mark Twain pipe, a couple of pipe bits, and uh, that's pretty much it, guys. And I just kind of wanted to share that with you as a first box opening video. I do hope you guys have a great day. I hope you guys are staying warm. No crazy, no kind of crazy winter storms like we had here. Um, but I, I know the whole country is going through like a, a weather, a weather event right now, some winter stuff. So, all right, guys. Well, other than that, that's pretty much all I had for today. So I do hope you guys have a wonderful day and uh, stay piping.